Hi, let's do a quick overview on comparisons between nuclear chemistry and traditional chemistry. And I'm really dialing this down to the two big difference, okay, our, our heavy hitters. Um, so first, with nuclear chemistry, our, primarily, our primary focus is the nucleus. Totally makes sense. It's going to be the protons and the neutrons. It's the stability of that nucleus. Whereas in traditional chemistry, uh, we deal with the electrons and mostly valence electrons. It's going to be sharing electrons, gaining electrons, losing electrons. Um, it's going to be the stability of atoms based on that valence shell, the electrons. Um, next, energy. So nuclear chemistry has severely high energy. Okay, we're thinking energy of the sun, all right? And that's going to be with our fusion. Even with fission, um, we're going to have the atomic bombs and nuclear energy. Um, in traditional chemistry, it has less energy than nuclear energy, but I don't want to give you a false sense here. It's not that traditional chemistry doesn't have a lot of energy. I mean, we have, you know, completely raised buildings with dynamite, you know, high explosives. Um, so do we have a lot of energy in traditional chemistry? Absolutely, but it's when you compare it to nuclear chemistry, they're like, oh yeah, this seems a little like baby energy when I'm comparing the energy of the sun. Um, so in comparison, nuclear chemistry um, has higher energy. So I tell my students, make two files in your brain. You have the traditional chemistry that you probably spent like two semesters learning, and it's your um, rate, you know, the kinetics, thermodynamics, um, equilibrium, acid bases. All of that is going to fall right here, traditional chemistry, dealing with the electrons. Um, primarily, okay, of course we talk about neutrons and protons here, but primarily dealing with electrons. And then you make a second file in your brain, and that is nuclear chemistry, okay, that it's a little bit different, that we focus and we deal with um, the protons and the neutrons, the stability of that nucleus, rather than um, looking at the entirety of the atom, focusing on the electrons in the valence shell. Okay, so really quick overview as you begin nuclear chemistry. Everything you've learned in chemistry so far, compartmentalize, open up a new folder in your brain and say, okay, I'm going to now do nuclear chemistry and it's a little bit, it's going to be just a little bit different. A lot of similarities, but a little bit different and unique. And unique enough to have a separate place in your brain. Okay, nice. Enjoy nuclear chemistry. It's really a lot of fun. Thanks.